War is hell. But war is also an incredible teacher, a brutal teacher. And it teaches you lessons that you will not forget. During an operation that I was in charge of, when all hell broke loose. We had multiple units out on the battlefield fighting the enemy. We had friendly Iraqi soldiers. We had US Army soldiers and US Marines, along with small elements of my SEAL team. And then the fog of war rolled in with its confusion and chaos and mayhem and with its gunfire and enemy attacks and screaming men and blood and death. And in that fog of war, through a series of mistakes and human error and poor judgment and Murphy's Law and just plain bad luck, a horrendous firefight broke out. But this firefight, it wasn't between us and the enemy. This firefight, tragically, was between us and us. Friendly forces against friendly forces. Fratricide. The mortal sin of combat. And the most horrific part of war. And when it was over, and the fog of war lifted, one friendly Iraqi soldier was dead. Two more were wounded. One of my men was wounded. The rest of my seals were badly shaken. And it was only through a miracle that no one else was killed. And then I told them that there was only one person at fault for what had happened. There was only one person to blame. And that person was me. I am the commander, I am the senior man on the battlefield, and I am responsible for everything that happens. Everything. And I will tell you something, it hurt. It hurt my ego, it hurt my pride to take the blame. But I also knew, I knew that to maintain my integrity as a leader and as a man, I had to take responsibility. And in order to do that, I had to control my ego so that my ego did not control me. And when a team takes ownership of its problems, the problems get solved. And that is true on the battlefield, it is true in business, and it is true in life. So I say, take ownership. Take extreme ownership. Don't make excuses. Don't blame any other person or any other thing. Get control of your ego. Don't hide your delicate pride from the truth. Take ownership of everything in your world, the good and the bad. Take ownership of your mistakes, take ownership of your shortfalls, take ownership of your problems, and then take ownership of the solutions that will get those problems solved. Take ownership of your mission. Take ownership of your job, of your team, of your future, and take ownership of your life.